traders, that moment is here. The update from zero to one million dollar challenge with the top propers. Hello traders, uh, you asking me to make a video regarding what happened with the challenge because I haven't posted anything about the challenge for like around uh, three weeks. You remember when I started that challenge, I started making a video every single day and showed you each and every time that I executed on my personal account. It was executed on my challenge account with the FTMO and challenge account with Alpha Capital because I also did uh, beside FTMO, Alpha Capital. And you all know what happened if you follow that. If you didn't follow, go my Instagram, uh, scroll down and you see there day one, day two and so on. Uh, you saw that they had some big problem with slippages and with two trades instead of me making like 1.5% uh, profit on two trades, even if the trade he didn't uh, take profit, I actually ended up in a loss around 1.5 uh, 2% from that specific trade. Again, even if my trade hit the take profit. So that's a liquidity provider problem because the slippage, it was huge. I didn't have any problem uh, with uh, Alpha Capital. I also own a ProForm and I know that many times there's nothing what they can do because this is how the market is working. And when you are trading on demo, you will have much uh, bigger delay in the execution. So that's why when you trade with pro firms, you can have like pretty big slippages. You also saw the comparison that I did with my live trading account and the funder accounts. When you saw that on my live accounts, it was no slippage, it was no slippage at all. And on the challenge accounts, even with the FTMO, uh, but more with Alpha Capital, I had a very big slippage and again, ended up in a loss even if the trade hit the take profit. Anyway, just go on my Instagram, scroll down and you can see all the details. Now, the reason uh, if, you didn't follow, if you don't follow me for a long time, the reason why I stopped doing those daily updates, it was because I'm trading in average like 10 days per month. So the update start to be, uh, started becoming a little bit boring because there was like a lot of days when I say, hello traders, I'm not gonna trade today. It was a little bit wasting of time from my side and it was nothing quality that I could provide to you. And in this video, you're gonna find out if I passed the FTMO verification and I got the final account or if I failed. And also you're gonna find out why I don't really like to trade on FTMO and most probably I will never trade again with them. Again, if you don't follow me for a long time, I'm doing this challenge only for you guys, for you to see that trading based on statistics and probabilities can bring you all the capital that you need. I mean, like in these days, if you are a consistent, profitable trader, trading can be very scalable. So basically you can grab as much capital as you need. That's why it's even like from zero to $1 million because I know $1 million is the magic number. And you'll see when the withdrawals will come that you don't really even need to make like uh, not even 10%, 20% return or stuff like that. You can make a lot of money even with like few percent. But again, we will get there. Why I'm saying that we'll get there is because I'm very confident. I know my trading system very well because it's based on statistics and probabilities. It's very predictable. And I uh, quite know the results already and I quite know when I will actually reach that 1 million dollars. Now, let's start uh, and talk about the update. Regarding the FTMO verification account, I passed it. So right now I am a FTMO fund trader. So basically I just got 100K out of the $1 million. So I need 900K more to go. You saw that I'm only getting like 100K accounts. Yes, so I could like get 200K accounts uh, size and I will uh, meet basically the target two times faster. But the reason is because 200K, it's a little bit uh, harder to afford for a lot of the traders. When the 100K account is like in average with the majority of the pro firms around $500. Of course, you can get 10K, 25K, 50K account and so on. But I think like 100K, which is cost like $500 most of the pro firms, 
it's something that you can afford in these days or you can make this effort if you want to make money out of trading don't forget that in trading money makes money regarding alpha capital you know that i had those uh, problem with them the problem persists uh, <laughs> one more time but again uh, i don't blame them so, so on this is uh, sometimes how the market is working when you basically trade on demo so with alpha capital i passed the challenge and i'm in the verification and more than this i am also in the verification with uh, rocket 21 i passed the challenge a few days ago and i am also in verification with funding pips like you see those are top pro firms that i choose because of uh, your comments on tiktok uh, your message on uh, on instagram I I didn't want to choose like any pro form i choose the pro form that had the, the most common answers from uh, your side guys of course uh, we need to wait for you know the payouts and everything to be able to give you a much precise uh, review regarding these uh, pro forms and if they are top or not when it comes to liquidity alpha capital they don't really meet the conditions for a top pro form but let's see uh on uh, the funder account and you know if i go to get the payout from them and then i will be able to give you a honest review not because what happened because again when you trade on demo there can be huge delays in the market yes so i don't want to let's say throw with rocks in alpha capital until i don't have like a complete uh feedback to give you regarding this perform now i have three performs that i'm in the verification with uh, them Basically, after I will pass this, I will have $300,000 more in capital and I will stay at $400,000 in total for this challenge. Now, I am expecting actually to pass this uh, verification account. So, this is where I am in this moment with the challenge from zero to one million dollars. I'm also thinking to start one more challenge with uh, another pro form. Leave here in the comments uh, which pro form should I choose next. I told you in the beginning of this video that I'm going to tell you why I will not trade again with FTMO. So I already have a 100k account. I need to trade on that uh, account. But it's something that uh, I don't like at this point about FTMO. We all know that FTMO is... Uh, the largest proprietary trading firm in the industry. After I passed, it basically took around seven days until they give me my funder account. That's a huge amount of time. I also have a pro firm, Funding Dynasty. And with my pro firm, after you pass the verification, you will get your credential for the funder account like in a maximum of 48 hours i didn't like also because i contacted the support from uh, ftmo after i saw that i'm not getting anything the support uh, team was a little bit uh, was rude i didn't like at all their attitude i feel like look we know that we are the best in the industry we don't care about your opinion you just need to wait and that's it it was not uh, just about that I waited that much but again the feeling that I had when the support uh, answered to me it was that we don't care at all about you we have so many traders and like shut up otherwise you know uh, we're not gonna give you the account at all this was uh, enough for me I don't want to trade uh, again with FTMO that's one of the reason and the second reason is that they basically had 10% profit target. The majority of the pro firms, like uh, Funding Dynasty has also, in these days, is an 8% profit target. Th those 2%, that difference, you know, it doesn't really sound that uh, big, but believe me, and most of you that are watching me already know, that can be huge. That can make a difference from you passing the challenge or failing that challenge. Now, tell me in the comments which pro form should I choose next? Because I will probably stop at these uh, five uh, pro forms at this moment because I am already uh, founder of the FTMO. I will not get another challenge account from FTMO, but uh, it's already there, the founder account. And I am trading with Rocket21, Alpha Capital, Founding Pips. And leave in a comment which pro form should be 
the number five pro firm that I'm trading with. If you want to be the first one that find out when I'm going to post the next uh, video regarding this uh, challenge, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also you can follow me on Instagram or uh, Telegram where I'm posting like uh, updates but in a shorter format regarding this challenge from zero to one million dollars. Also, if you are looking to start trading based on statistics and probabilities and want to find out more about what this trading concept is about, you can book a free Zoom meeting with my team in the link below. So you can find out how easy it is to trade when you never take decisions, so there is no stress, no emotions, no fear of missing out or anything like this. Everything is predictable and stress-free. Book a call, see exactly what this trading concept is about and who knows, maybe see you in my mentoring program. Take care.